I just want to set this straight right now. There, yeah, I'll look you in the face when I say this. There is no such thing as a superfood. Does not exist. Ne never has. It's just, it's just food, okay? This, it's just a food. Like, yeah, some foods have more of, you know, whatever nutrient than others do, but that's just, that's just food. <laughs> like, yeah, if you're, you know, if your usual diet is nothing but junk, then sure, adding these things is going to help you. But it, it's, it's just food. And the way you really know that the word superfood is bullshit is how frequently the new superfood changes. Like it was pomegranates for a while, before that it was yogurt or cottage cheese, and then it became acai berries, and then it was quinoa, and then it was kale, and then it was coconut water, and it just changes constantly. And that's how you really know that there is really no, there's nothing behind it. It's just whatever they feel like selling. That's all it is. And yeah, that's, that's it. That's really it. Like, and you know, I'm not, you know, I'm not necessarily complaining because I like the taste of pomegranate. It's, you know, I liked having it in a bunch of stuff and you can still find like the pomegranate ice cream bars and stuff and they're good, but just, it's just food. Like, there's nothing, there's no special, you know, supernatural healing power in this thing. It's just, it's just vitamins and sugar water. That's pretty much it. <laughs> and what's really, really irksome about superfoods for me is that a lot of them come from poorer countries. Off the, and the places where they are actually grown, people once relied on them as just an everyday staple part of their diet. And now that, it, now that they've become, and once they become a fad for us in, you know, the wealthy countries, they suddenly become too expensive for the people who actually grow them and need them. You know, we suck up all of the supply and jack up all the prices. Because we feel like it. Because it seems cool and exotic. So, yeah, that's that's my piece on superfoods. Just, yeah. But anyway, like I said, I do actually like pomegranates when I get the chance to have them. So, let's get into how you actually deal with them. Now, the first thing to know is you don't want to just whack straight through it. Because, you know, it's filled with all of those, you know, juice pops. 